So, this right here is called a space mouse. Apparently I have never, I've never heard of this before, but it has come out about three years ago, somewhere around there. It doesn't have that much specs to it, um, but it is for supposed to be Windows 10, as well as Apple OS X. So Space Mouse uh, Pro, this is, um, I didn't get that rare of Space Mouse, so I didn't really have a chance to compare it between the two. Apparently it's supposed to be a mouse. I really have nothing else to really say about it. What's up YouTube, it's your partner, Mag320 back with another video. I'm here to talk about tech stuff as well as audio and video stuff. So if you have anything to uh, for me to display on the channel, definitely check me out and we'll see what's going with on. With that said, let's go ahead and unbox this and see what this is about. So yeah, let's go ahead and get this unboxed. So the nice little black box here shows what it is. Unseal it real quick. And uh, yeah, it has a little bit of padding to it. Uh, so far, so good. And this is pretty much the main attraction here. Let's go ahead and pull this out. That is the layout of it. Uh, it's supposed to be on the left side there. Go ahead and pull this out of the bag here. Uh, nice black. Black, matte black as a matter of fact. Yeah, I like the design the layout. Probably looks like this button doesn't move as much besides up, down, left, right. Nice set of buttons here so far. Yeah, I like it so far. It doesn't doesn't really offer much, but and then yeah, this at the bottom just shows the uh, the name and everything. So let's do a quick comparison here to one one of the uh, keyboard I had, mini keyboard I had. But yeah, so far I like it so far. Let's go ahead and uh, do something with this. All right, so what do I think about this so far? Well, I recently just found out that this is actually a mouse for a 3D graphics program. So the reason why I haven't heard about it is because it wasn't really publicized as a regular mouse. It's more for Cinema 4D and or 3DS Max and things like that. It's more of a, more of a guidance mouse rather than just a, like a regular mouse that you can use on a computer. It does light up as a matter of fact let me take this off here and as you can see you can see it lights up and it works the way it should but halfway past that it's not much more outside of a graphics mouse let me and just leave the tape on there but it's a really nice mouse it has a whole bunch of functions on there this doesn't really move here but it does it does act like a camera you know you move it as if it was like a camera switch or something like that but it doesn't really move here but it's really it's it's heavy it's pretty much sleek um, has pretty much the same set of functions as a keyboard i like it so far um i'm not sure if i'm actually gonna get into graphics uh, or i'm sorry animation or anything like that just yet but um i really do like this mouse i definitely would recommend it for all those um, animation heads out there so this is definitely worth um, getting if you like doing animation and things like that there are drivers that go with this and as well as the software so if you're willing to spend 286 dollars oops about to drop my shit if it's up to you, you can get this on Amazon or b or whatever it is, but definitely worth getting. So what's called Space Mouse Pro from 3D Connection, um, you can pretty much get anywhere. So if you have any other products that you would like for me to display on the channel, definitely hit me up. Destroy the like button, put a comment, share it, you know, the whole nine, and I'll make an attempt to try to get some more products on to you. The next thing is going to be Hyra Pro X. That is for that. So you definitely it's best to see that on the next video. Actually recording this on the on the second day because I actually fell asleep. I was too tired to pretty much do anything. Destroy a comment, the whole nine, share, and I will definitely see you guys on the next video.